Hello everyone and welcome back to the 29th Sedona International Film Festival. I'm your host Carol Kahn. We'd like to thank our sponsors Northern Arizona Healthcare and also Yavapai College for the wonderful facility and lunch and everything else that they're doing for us. It's amazing. And I'd like to introduce to you two filmmakers from the film It's Spring. Would you introduce yourself please? Sure. Um, I'm Anna Kachatrian, co-producer of the film. Uh, I'm Alexander Kachatrian. I'm producer and the lead actor for movie, and uh, <clears throat> this was my idea to make that movie because uh, we are we are a small country and um, we need that kind of movie. And when you say we need that kind of movie, explain what does that mean? Uh, it's uh, about about love. Movie is about love, about love for each other, about love for family, about love uh, for our country, and uh, we have uh, also war in our movie. So uh, it's all about it's all about us, about our culture, culture, about traditions, and living in Armenia. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And you yeah. both are from Ar Armenia. Yes. Yeah. Correct. And when did you come to the United States? Um, we actually moved to the States a while ago. It's been 30 years, uh, but he's been uh, one foot in and one foot out, so constantly back and forth between Armenia and the States and working there, coming back, working here, so couldn't leave it behind and then, you know, went back and created this beautiful film, so. And you still have family there? Yes. Yes. Yes, you both have family yes. there. Awesome. Well, we'd like to take uh, just see a clip of the film okay. and then we'll talk more. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. Great. Let me get here. time gets to me again. Oh my you goodness. Know. So um, the, the story is about um, the love for one's country and also the love for one's family. Yes. So you growing up in Armenia, you also served, did you not, in the military? Uh, no, that time uh, when I uh, have to serve in the military, uh, it was Soviet, uh, Soviet time and uh, theater where I'm, where, where I'm working. Theater uh, give me uh, give me break. Uh, they didn't leave me to go to uh, 
serving the military. So you worked in, in theater? And yeah, I'm why. working in theater at that time. And right. uh, okay. I was so busy in theater. And theater uh, take for me, I would say, they, uh, they Bronya made, uh They made him exempt, I guess. So they vouched for him, and they didn't let him go. Sort of. <laughs> so basically, he was needed in the theater, and he was acting and doing movies all the time. So. Wow! Did, so they actually I know. allowed that? That seems. I know. I guess. Yeah, it's uh, it was. Um, I was so young in that time, and but I, I uh, uh, already have a lot of uh, roles in uh, theater. So uh, theater lived me. Yeah, they, they uh, Kind of made an exception, yeah. I guess. Right. So, um, when you were growing up, and was this like filmed in Russia as well? No. So this was in Armenia. Yeah, it's okay. in Armenia. Yeah. Okay. Film makes it in Armenia. All the film makes in Armenia, and uh, here is nothing about Russia or about. It's just uh, for uh, us, for us, for uh, our nation and uh, our people. Mm -hmm. But I think issues in there are kind of global too, because yeah, there is a know, there is a global war, issues. You know, right. Look at what's going because, on in the uh, world. There is a, there may, we try to make parallels about the soldiers uh, and uh, killer, because it's different things. The soldier has a, a moral, has a, a mission, is a protector, mm -hmm. but uh, some. People who just uh, Kill. just killer. Mm -hmm. It's not not soldier. And about is the, the, the also about uh, culture and uh, violence and uh, art. Uh, yeah, it's, about it's culture, art, and. Um, I'll, I'll continue his thought because I know what he wants to say. <laughs> so um, we try to uh, show, like he said, parallels, a kind of show uh, the difference between, you know, creating art and destroying art. Like you, you noticed in the uh, trailer, our hero is a violinist. So there's like that, I don't want to give anything away because it's a beautiful film. You have to see it. But there is this destruction of not just the war, but the destru destruction of art and the violin and the, you know, the people who create the art. So um, unfortunately, it is also based on true events that yeah, happen in Armenia. So it's kind of, it's our story, but it's also global where others can relate to it, especially now with, you know, the world has kind of become smaller with social media and everything, you know, and we could see like things that are happening out there today's like environment and events that are going on and war and you know you have that portrayed here and how war is just this destructive force like it's just it destroys there's nothing good about it right you know and when you say it's based on true events what events are you so speaking of? back in 2016 yeah it's uh we have uh, some war four days war in uh, 2016 and uh, it's true story it's uh, it's based on true story uh, because a lot of people who uh, who was um, in art goes to war. So, so uh, uh, volunteers. Volunteers. So in 2016, what happened? It was peace. Uh, but we were attacked. Uh, Armenia was attacked um, and in the middle of the night. And it lasted four days. That's why we call it four-day war. So our soldiers were able to kind of stop it and push back. But uh, during those four days, you know, as soon as it broke out, so many people volunteered and went, even artists. You know, they, everybody dropped everything and went to go protect uh, motherland. And I know even some people from the states, you know, they bought tickets and went to Armenia, you know, Armenians who had come just like us to go protect uh, the motherland. So hope, you know, um, uh, 
Not hopefully. What's the word? I forgot. Um, oh, my God. Thankfully, that was the word. Thankfully, it lasted only four days. So um, when that broke out and him seeing everyone volunteering and that love that they showed for their country to go and protect it, he decided to make this movie. Yeah. Now, unfortunately, by the time we, you know, created this it took a while. Um, another war broke out, which I, I'm not sure if you're familiar with the 2020 war. Azerbaijan attacked yeah. again yeah, Armenia, yeah. and that one lasted 44 days. That's what we, we, we didn't uh, say about that war. But it's, yeah, it's, it's a long story. It's a long so, story. Um, we lost but anyway, a lot of people. Uh, but, we, um, so just want to say... <laughs> saying we just want to say we're against war because it's just this destructive force but we want to show what it does so as the film was being filmed we kind of had to stop it because of the events and COVID so this film has gone through two wars and a pandemic <laughs> so it's it's insane yeah. and when we were um Putting post doing post production. Post production, uh, our colleague, our crew member, uh, was is in Ukraine. His studios are there. So <laughs> when we were doing the post production, him and the director were there. The war there broke out. So thankfully, he had returned to Armenia earlier, but our director got stuck. And we had this huge ordeal trying to bring him, sneak him back to Armenia and sneak the movie back to Armenia so that we can have this film. So it's just, <laughs> oh my gosh. it's a crazy story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Too I much mean, crazy, here, yeah. It's like, oh my goodness, I couldn't even imagine. I mean, yes. you actually live that life in order yeah. to have to do that. Wow. That was crazy. Well, and, and the camera loves you. Yeah. Anyway, so <laughs> yeah. Thank you. you look great um, Thank on you. the film. Thank you. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Yeah. We're happy it's here. We're happy we're here. We're, you yeah. know, just blessed to be able to do this and and be here. Yeah. So tell us how can people find out about your film? Um All right. The film is actually playing today. Uh, at 4 o'clock and then I think it's screening again on the 24th at four o'clock so we're really happy we're hoping to see everyone there uh, we do have the film has its own little um, I guess Facebook page and Instagram it's Garuna film now Garuna means spring in Armenian but you know we wrote it in English letters but we just kept it like that so it's G-A just the way you hear it Garuna G-A-R-U-N-A film uh, if if they can uh, follow us, uh, we'll post and trying to be very active in you know posting and um, promoting the film. Awesome, so that's one way to hear about it. <laughs> well, thank you both for being here. We really appreciate it. This is thank also going to be on Facebook us. Live on the Sedona Film Festival Facebook page. Thank and you. For most of you who uh, need to follow us and hashtag, it's hashtag SIFF23 and Sedona Film Fest 23. And thank you both for being thank with you us. Thank you for having thank you. us. We look forward to seeing you during the week. I can't wait to hear about audience reaction. On Same the film. here. Thank you. <laughs> All right. And we'll be back thank with you. more from the Sedona International Film Festival after this.